So we showed you how to use manual mode. Now what I want to show you is if you want to change any settings in manual mode, you have to go in a different way. So I'm going to show you how to change the carriage up speed, so how fast it's going to go up, the down speed, turntable speed, the tension, all these within just manual mode when you're using it. And then also, since we're going to be in that section of the board, I'm going to show you how to change the photo eye delay for your automatic modes. So in order to get into those settings, we need to power the unit off. And then when we turn it on, right when it turns on, we have to hold the start and the OK button at the same time. So I'm going to turn it on and hold those in until it flashes G1. So it's flashing G1 and 11. That's the setting for G1 right now. G1 is the turntable speed. So I'm going to click OK. If I want to make changes, I'm going to go to 10 and click OK. So I've made those. That allows me to go to G2. G2 is the carriage up speed. So if I click OK, I can make changes to that. I'm going to go to 65 and click OK. Now, if I want to go to the next one, I hit the plus sign. That's going to be G3, down speed. Click OK again, so I can go to 65. Click OK. Then I want to go up to G4, which is the tension. So I'll do that. It's showing 25 for tension. Let's say I want to go down to 20. I'm going to go hit OK and go down to 23 and hit OK. Now I can go up to G10. So G1 through G4 are just settings within manual mode. The only other one that you want to go into here would be G10, and that's for actually automatic mode. Automatic mode, it's going to be the photo eye delay, so it's at three seconds right now. I'm going to keep it there, but I just want to show you guys how to access that. Any of these other parameters in here, you don't want to go into and make changes unless you're talking to a handle it technician because there are changes that can affect the performance of the machine. So if I want to make these changes that I did, just like before, earlier, to save, I click Save, and then I do OK. Now I made those changes in manual mode.